Hello, I'm Morilibus here, and today I'm doing a test. We are going to check whether looting 3 has any impact on the rare drops. I'm using dispensers filled with skeleton eggs, so we will get a mixture of wither skeletons and regular skeletons. And we will compare their drops and hopefully see a significant difference. So those dispensers are right full, which gives us 576 entities or mobs that will drop down into this spot. And then I will smack them with a sword and record the loot in the chest and go from there. I've seen a lot of discrepancies, I guess, towards this. I've seen people say it does make a difference. I've seen it doesn't. I've seen videos. I've seen people stating, I've looked in the game code and it doesn't make a difference. And then you see the same thing, I've looked in the game code and it does make a difference. So, who do you believe? Nobody, Yatsu. No, I don't know. I figured I'd just do a test for myself, but why not just record it and share my findings with you guys? Let's see, I mean, if there's a significant difference, then I will probably just continue looting, uh, using looting 3. If there's not much difference, then there may be no points. But anyway... Let's get started. Alright, first we will do the non-looting sword. There we go. 576. I'm going to convert back to survival. And then start whacking these guys. Oh! Not cool, skeleton. Well, gotta reset. Alright, we are reset. I've added in some blocks. Apparently skeletons will shoot. I thought they fixed that, but no. There's certain corners where they can shoot you through the, the wall. So that's the southwest corner. So I blocked it off, and I've checked it on versus this side. I said I checked it versus this side. Well, okay. 576. Made some modifications. I don't think they should be able to see me and kill each other this time. Let's get started. I may just stand back just in case. Alright, got a gas trying to kill me. That unfortunately is already full, but we got nine skulls. And then all these guys, so this is with non looting. Just going to throw everything in this chest for now, and I'll have to put a double chest. Or a triple, quadruple. Okay, I'm going to go back to creative and maybe put a roof on this thing. Okay, so here we go. Non looting. We've got nine skulls, so that's it for rare drops. Plus the. Got seven bows, and. 39 swords. So I wrote that down on the sign. Seven bows, 39 swords, nine skulls. Wow, nine skulls out of 500 and. What was it? 76? That's awful. Anyway, and then the other regular drops. So we should see an increase of these for sure. And we'll see what happens to the other stuff. So I will start up the other one and we'll do the looting. Alright, we're ready to go. Got my looting three sword. And I'm just gonna start whacking away. Oh, we had some casualties. I tried to create an expanding chamber in here. I'll have to reset. Oh, 
All right. 576 again. Just made a slight modification, expanded here just so they have more room. So I found it was bottlenecking in there and I I couldn't hit them. I'd have to kind of slow down my strikes. So it took a while, so hopefully this will help speed this up. All right, looting three is done, and this is what we got. This time we got nine bows, 44 swords, and 18 skulls. Almost double. Well, double in the skulls. Not so much in the swords and bows. Actually, just a small increase. Definitely an increase in bones, arrows, and all that. So definitely, as we all knew, increases those drops, but that's not what we were testing anyway. It was really for these guys. So, I'm going to do another test and see if we get the same results. Alright, round two. It's going a little faster. This time I'm doubling it. So I've got two dispensers up there full of eggs. So that is 1152 if my math is correct. Now, of course, there is some, because we're getting both withers and regular skeletons, there is some randomness to it, obviously. So, I mean, in this circumstance, maybe we just got significantly less wither skeletons than in this test. But if I do it enough times, and there is a trend, then that, to me, is enough, at least for me, that I will consider using... Uh oh <laughs> My frames are dropping really fast! That I will continue using Looting 3 to collect Wither Skulls. Assuming my game does not crash. 800. 200 to go. I better stop recording. Alright, so we got 1152 here and one frame per, per second. Let's hope I can get through this so if I can kill some off things should improve although first they're gonna get worse let's see if I can make it through I might have to do a smaller test finally getting some frames back I turned down all the video settings and it did take a while uh, what I find odd this happened last time too I've yet to get a skull and I seem to get skulls at the very end. Same with the looting. Had no skulls till I killed like the last hundred or so. Which I find odd. Same for the swords. No swords yet. Something is going on. Well, oh, now we start getting sword. Okay. So we got about 150 left. Now let's see if we start getting swords and heads. And I mean, I was getting coal, so I was definitely killing them, and I can see the wither skeletons falling in front of me, and I could see them falling in front of me before. So it's not like I was only killing regular skeletons up to that point. My sword's about to break. Still no heads. Now getting a lot of swords. Now we're getting some heads. Very weird. We may try another test with just like a hundred in here and see what we get. Twenty-three. 
That is weird, though. We got all those at the very end. So I think in order for me to do that test again with the looting sword, I would have to do the full scale with the thousand mobs just to keep it consistent. I don't know what's going on there. If anybody knows? That seems really strange to me. But anyway, I shall continue forth. And let's get some results. Alright, I'm gonna do it again. Full scale. So 1152 mobs. And I'll bring my computer down to a halt again. Gonna use a looting sword. And then I got in my inventory a regular sword in which I will repair the looting sword part way through. So it doesn't break. And we will record our findings in these chests. Alright. Here we got kind of a separation. <laughs> Probably because these guys are too high, but it's not always... They can get pushed into there, the Wither Skeletons. I kind of did check to see if that would be a vital, viable way of separating them. But it isn't. You can see regular Skeletons in there too. So anyway, we have yet to get a skull, and we just started to get swords. So I don't know if there's something else going on, like if there is a certain amount of them, they will not drop any rare drops, like skeletons do. They drop their bows, and they've been dropping their bows throughout this whole test. But I've only just gotten coal up until just recently here. We are down to about 540, and now we're starting to get swords. And I'm just going to do something here. There we go. I also want to try something. When I start to get skulls, I'm going to slow down. And I'm going to do one hit at a time. And we will see if we can get multiple skulls with one kill. So we'll see if looting affects rare drops in that way, in terms of quantity of rare drops. Which I don't think so, but why not test it while we're doing this? Okay, before I break the sword... Okay, we got our first skull drop. Now I'm going to slow it down. So far, only one singles. It's happening quite frequently. Well, fairly. So I'm going to do another test with just 150 mobs in here and see what we get. Of course, now that I say it happens quite frequently, we're not getting any. <laughs> okay, two singles, single, single. Yes, yeah, so I don't think it affects the quantity. Those are singles, I do believe. Okay, so that test is done. We got a total of 45 skulls compared to 23, so almost double. And then in terms of other drops, bows, 21, nope, yep, 21, <laughs> versus 15, sure, swords, a lot, <laughs> versus not quite as much, it's almost, 
19 more than that one. So I don't know. I mean, it looks definitely like it looting does affect it. To me, I would say it does. In terms of the rare drops, I mean, we got almost double skulls. We did last time as well. So I'm going to keep using looting, personally. As to me, I think it, it looks like it does help. Anyway, I'm going to do some other little tests because something else is going on there. I don't know why I'm only getting the skulls towards the very end. And I am clearly killing wither skeletons prior to, or I would not be getting the coal. But yeah, I will share those results shortly. Okay, small scale of tests, 200 mob eggs. Okay, so there we got eight. Again, don't know how many of those were wither skeletons and regular skeletons. I'm gonna do the same for looting. All right, 200 mobs coming up with looting. All right, small scale 200 skull tests. Looks like we got more swords and whatnot, but in terms of skulls, what did we get last time? We got eight, this time we got nine. Not a huge difference in this test, but overall the trend does seem to indicate that it does make a difference. So, yeah. I will continue using looting, regardless. But anyway, hope you enjoyed. Hopefully this was somewhat useful. Again, not conclusive, but some more data anyway. Thank you for watching. Enjoy. Bye-bye.